Here's a magnificent song that was put on the map by a lot of great cover versions. But today I want to take a look at the original by Leonard Cohen. Let's dive into this Hallelujah guitar lesson. Now if you're looking for the Jeff Buckley cover, I do have a lesson on that on my channel. For that version, you're going to need a capo, but I figured this would be a great version to have as well, which doesn't use a capo. And the chords are pretty much the same. There's just a couple inversions and things that Jeff Buckley does, but these chords will work with both versions. So let's get into it. There are five chords you need to know, and we're in the key of C. So the first chord is C. We've got three, two, open, one, open from the fifth string down. The next chord you're gonna need to know is A minor. And I just move one finger, check out that change there from the fifth string down, open, two, two, one, open. And we've got an F, which I play as a bar chord here. One, three, three, two, one, one. And then G, you could use any G you want. I actually play this folk version where I just use the third fret of the low E and then the third fret on the first string, muting the fifth string, and then play the rest of the strings open. And that's just great because I can switch. There's a lot of C to G, and look at how easy this is. Now the last chord you'll need to know is E, and that's just from the fifth string down, open, two, two, one, open, open. So you've got the chord shapes. Those are all the ones you'll need to know for the song. Now the other thing I want to talk about is this is in a triple meter. So we're going to count it. I like to count it in six, eight, so it's going to go. One, two, three, four, five, six, one, two, three, four, five, six, one, two, three, four, five, six, one, two, three, four, five, six. So with the strum hand, I'm just going down, 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 down. I'm doing six strums, all downs, per bar. One, two, three, four, five, six. And you can add a slight accent on the one and then also the four. So one, two, three, four, five, six. So that's the groove, and then we're gonna go C to A minor. So, I've heard there was an A minor, C, A minor. All right, from there, we bring in the bar chord there, F, one, two, three, four, five, six, G, C, G. Okay, that's the first half, here it is again. Well, I've heard there was an A minor, C, back to A minor, then F, G, C, G. Okay, the second half, we go C, F, G, A minor. Okay, so that's a quick change there. That is three strums on F, one, two, three, and then three strums on G. One, two, three, and then A minor for a full bar, F for a full bar. Okay, then we go G, full bar, E, A minor. Then in the last bar, I like to just let that chord ring out. So let me back up and here's the second half of the verse. Here we go. Well, it goes like this, the F, the G, A minor, F, G, E, A minor, and then just let it ring. So that's the first half of the song, or the verse, then we go into the chorus. But before we do that, if you're new to the channel, I wanna give you a gift. And what it is, is my fretboard guide. You see, a lot of these chords we're playing in this song, like C and G and E, these chords can be used to actually map out a framework to understand the entire guitar neck. And this is one of the most useful things you can do as a guitar player, is learn a system for understanding the neck. So I wanna give you this completely for free. Just go to John johnmclennan.com slash fretboard guide and you can grab that right now as my gift to you. Now from there we go into the chorus and that's where Leonard Cohen sings Hallelujah, Hallelujah. 
Okay, so I'm spending two bars on each chord. I've got an F for two bars, and then an A minor for two bars. So it's Halle F, two, three, four, five, six, two, two, three, four, five, six, A minor, four, five, six, one, two, three, four. Then we do it again. We go back to F, Hallelujah. C two three four five six G two three four five six C two four five six G two three four five six. So that's a lot of changing there to C G C G. So you want to get comfortable with that change. Again, you can use this chord if you want. It's just more comfortable for me to make that smooth change like that. So backing up, here's the entire chorus played as one piece. Here we go. Hallelujah, go to A minor. Hallelujah, C to G. Hallelujah. And right here. Da -da 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 -da. Right, and then we go back to the top. So those are the only two sections you need to know the verse and the chorus. And again, it's just five chords. You take all of that and then plug it into the form of the song and jam along. So hope you have fun practicing this song. And remember to help you understand how these chords can unfold through the entire guitar neck and you can just learn the fretboard in the simplest way, go to johnmcclennan.com slash fretboard guide and grab just this one page PDF. It's gonna be one of the most useful PDFs you'll ever see for learning the fretboard and it's completely for free. So hope you enjoy that as my gift to you. As always, thanks for watching and if you liked this video, I think you'll really enjoy this one next.